We've been learning a lot of tricky spellings like EA and PH. Today, we get to dive into our new reader. In our reader, we're going to see some of these tricky spellings. We know great readers practice reading spelling alternatives to get better at accurately decoding words. So as good readers today, we're going to practice decoding some tricky words from our reader so that we're ready to read our first chapter. We're going to do this by first sounding out the word, then putting the sounds together, and finally saying the word all together. First word. Let's sound this out. Gr, eight, br, it, in. Let's put those sounds together. Great Britain. Say it with me. Great Britain. Brilliant. Next word. Now, sound it out. What's it say? You're up. Say it with me. You're up. Nice. We see in this image over here that Europe is a continent. Interesting. Next word. Now sound it out. Say it together. What does it say? Native Americans. Say it together. Native Americans. Nice. We see in this image that Native Americans are people. Next word. Sound it out. What's it say? Yes, war. Say it with me. War. We see in this image that two countries are fighting in a war. Last one. Sound it out. Say those sounds together. What does it say? Yes, signature. Say it with me. Signature. Beautiful. We see in this image that writing your signature is just writing your name usually in cursive. Now, there's going to be a lot of our sight words in our reader too. So we're going to really quickly practice reading some of those sight words. You're going to read the word first, then we'll read it together. Ready? First word. Read it. Yes. Said. Next. Yes. What? Next one. Read it. Yes, with. Last word, let me hear you. Yes, years. Oh, kiss your brain. Now, you're going to do a quick matching activity with the words that we just read. Once you match all the tiles, we'll get into our reader today.